Hello everyone and welcome back. Today we're going to be trying out this Jergens brand. This is the Natural Glow Instant Sun. Um, this obviously is a sunless tanning mousse. Um, this claims to give you a natural looking color instantly. So it says that it dries in 60 seconds. I have it in the shade Light Bronze. Um, so we're just going to dive right into this. Uh, I don't have a mitt or anything, so I'm just going to use my hand, which it does say on the back that you can use because it is a stain free um, product. So I'm just putting a decent amount on my hands and dispersing it evenly onto both hands and just working that through just like you would a lotion or you know anything that you're trying to get some full coverage on now the tip on the back says not to focus too heavily on like your elbow areas or your knees and places that it might like grab the pigment and end up looking unnatural so my first impression is it feels nice I mean I've used sunless tanners before um it doesn't feel too sticky and, you know, the smell at first was fairly pleasant. Um, if you've used sunless tanning before, you know that it has like a very distinct smell to it. Um, this one was like very pleasant at first. And then as it processed, you could kind of get more of that like classic smell that you would expect. Um, but if it doesn't bother you, then just go for it. So, I've never tried it on my face. There's nothing on this bottle that says that you can't use it on your face. So I wanted to give it a shot. Uh, we're going on vacation this weekend. I kind of wanted to just jumpstart the whole tanning thing. You can see there, it definitely stains your hands. So um, thankfully my nails were pretty safe, but I needed to book it uh, quickly to the bathroom after the application because you need to get that washed off. So I'm going to run and wash that off and hope that it doesn't stain. So here I am immediately back from the bathroom and my hands look great. Make sure you focus on the in between your fingers and getting all that uh, mousse off so you're not having any stainage. So um, here's like a before and after. I see a difference. We're talking like maybe 60 seconds that it took me, I, I spent some time in the bathroom to make sure that I washed it all off. So that's the before and after. And I'm really impressed with this. Um, there's a little bit of stickiness, but it's not too bad. Um, it's to be expected. This does not say that you need to wash it off. So it's not like you're supposed to let it process and then rinse it. It's just, you know, you're just going to have it. And then when you shower, um, I'm assuming you're going to lose most of that pigment, but it does say that if you want a darker tan, um, the next day to just reapply it again. So, um, I'm impressed guys. I think this is worth a shot. If you like me, you know, don't want to be at the pool with pasty white skin and you just need a little bit of extra color. Um, I, I'm really happy with this. So I recommend giving this a shot. Let me know if you've tried it or if you have a sunless tanner that you prefer. I would love to try others. So um, let me know in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. I always appreciate the support and please revisit.